the orange one here. So um, I went back down here and check this out. Here is the sky bear. He's missing his face. And he, I am wearing, uh, I think, said face. Yeah, I got his face. <laughs> he, he might dismember uh, or disarm me here if I'm not careful, but I think I can actually charge him. Oh, he disarmed me. So guess what I'm going to do? Get the freezing. It's got a chemical on it, good. And let's get this other one. These should both kind of freeze him up a little bit. Ah, oh man, he's he's being annoying. Okay. No. Can I? Let's see. I'm gonna have to maybe juke here. And equip, equip. I'm gonna try and kind of go over here and see if um, I don't know. Maybe I'm. It's gonna take a step back or two. Is he gonna charge me? I'm not sure what, what he's gonna do. You know, what I'm gonna try right now. Is I'm not gonna use the blast. Let's see if I can freeze him. Yeah, he's frozen now. Haha, <laughs> take that. Okay, so I'm just gonna let him be frozen over there. And I don't know. I don't want to get frozen myself, though, is the thing. Just gonna freeze him. Oh, let's replace that. Uh, I have a nuclear cell here. gonna keep on trying to freeze you. <laughs> um, let's see. I do have some sower seeds. I don't really want to mess up my blast cannon though. Is the one thing that I'm a little bit nervous about and my temperature myself is actually pretty low. If I try and I'm gonna just throw the sower seed. Yeah, our blast cannon just got destroyed by that. Well, guess what? If that's what's gonna take to kill that honest, that's what's gonna take to kill so <laughs> this guy. I mean, let's see. He might. He might. Uh, charge me a little bit soon. I could maybe... It looks like he's almost trying to fall back. Don't you, don't you move there, buddy. You know what I could do is actually, if I'm trying to just kill him and get the experience, I could just like... Get a real, real grenade out here. Let's uh, change out the sorrow seeds, and let's go for resonance. Yep. Take that, buddy. I am uh, going to see what I can do about maybe maneuvering a little bit closer while he's wounded from that. Um. I think I could charge and then try to dismember. Oop, here we go. He's He just charged me there. I'm going to see what we can do here. There we go. <laughs> I got dismember there. I actually took his head off. Oh, man. That's how you kill Sadamas there. A couple grenades, a couple lucky hits with the right weapons. Um, let's get these charging, sure. I don't know what happened to my, uh, distortion thing. I don't know, I think I must have, like, placed it somewhere. I'm not exactly sure where, what happened to it. But now we don't have a blast cannon. So, change in strategy, I suppose. 
We do have this freeze cannon, which seems pretty good, and we do have an Angen rifle, which is almost as good as a blast cannon, and it also doesn't take up as much um, energy. So what what do we have here? We got a, sl a slimy snail mother. We got inflate axons and try and dismember blurry. Let's just take a couple steps back. Yeah get the cold on them a little bit. See you who comes my way. Uh, what are you right here? Oh, you're a flaming one. Is that gonna mess them up? I think... I'm gonna try and... Ooh, ow. Actually, no. Let's not do that. Juke. No, that that's not a way up. Uh oh. This is not good. Um and we do have salve injectors actually. Why don't I get one of those salve injectors? I think I'm getting to the point where I'm gonna probably start seeing those a lot more from like merchants. I have six of them. Um can I... I don't know, we don't have too many abilities right now. Let's uh, hook and drag you. Ooh, that was not good. I'm going to see if I can jump away. Yeah, okay, cool. Fall back. Hit. Yeah. Take that. <laughs> okay, I, I really like this freeze freeze weapon. It's good with with a, a bleeding, you know, combo. Get someone bleeding and then freeze. That, that seems to work really really nicely. Now, where did I come from? Okay, there is a way, but it's just not super clear. I thought I was trying to go up there, but okay. No, there's like acid or something. On the ground there. Okay. Ports eight. Let's see. I think I can. Yeah. All right. Cool. Oh, what just happened there? I think this thing maybe just pulled me like halfway across the map. Okay. It did. That's fine. <laughs> now I was thinking going to the ruins, but what is, what is that right there? The snail egg. Okay. Well, we want to break those. We don't want more snails. I think we got the slime mother, though, so I think we should be okay in that regard. Oh my gosh, there's a bear. What's a bear doing down here? Is that also a corpse of... Yeah, that's what I thought. I had a good feeling over here that this might have some good stuff. Okay, I can't equip that, and that's not the type of weapon that I wanted, but... I mean, it's kind of nice. Kind of get some of that honey, too. And it's... We're not really got, had any issues with disease, though, so... It doesn't really make all that much sense. Oh, here's the snail mother. I'm gonna try and flurry first to cleave. Yeah, and that should help me with my dismember chance, I think. Well, I really cleaved there. So I think we've. Uh. Maybe. I'm gonna try and drag a. Okay, this thing is tough, but we've got it basically dead. Okay, cool. Okay, now it's got a bunch of the little ones, I think. Okay, cool. Uh-oh, maybe I should fall back right now. It seems like, yeah. I'm kind of hurting. Oh, now I'm, I've got acid. Ow, ow, ow. 
Oh, that's a broken egg. I, we could also go down, but I don't think that's probably a good move either. I think what I really should do if I'm being responsible here is go out and try and go to a ruin. Um, and try and get a cybernetic that way. There we go. Take that, quartz monkey. Let's, uh, we'll restart this fire here. Oh. Um, and then let's try and cook up. I'm gonna actually, you know what we're gonna do? We're gonna do this. We get psych psychometry at level two. Cool. Okay, that's, that's great. Um, can I learn how to, I just want to make sure that this if I can oh no I can't I can't figure it out um I just I'm wondering if there's anything else that I've picked up that I might be able to figure out um no I don't think that I can do anything with any of that stuff anything in our oh what about this Oh, it has electromagnetic shielding as well. Oh, cool. Very interesting. So that's a really good weapon, by the way, if you're trying to take out stuff that has armor. So we now have like a solid way to do that. Yeah, I wish that that was, that would let me get that stuff. Oh, what? I can make antimatter cells now. That's amazing. What about nuclear cells? I think I already know that. I think we might have, there's just like, there's some stuff that I just, I don't want to lose permanently if I don't have to. Yeah, okay, fair enough. And I think I've learned a lot of this stuff, but I just wanna make sure that we got it all. Yeah, it looks like we do. It looks like we totally do. Okay, I got the antimatter cell, but that was it. Yeah, I don't need to do anything more for an enemy like that. While we're here, I feel like I should just clear this level out. It seems like a waste not to. Yep, and look, that's gonna be a new um, self-injector. That replaces them we just used earlier. Here we go. Yep, dead root tuber. Cool. And if we can get more then we get a huge return on our investment. Now, I don't know if I want to keep on exploring or I think we should probably, yeah. Let's go, let's go to the merchants. It's We've been doing a lot of this recently and I want to see if we can find some stuff, um, some ruins or something. The thing is, without the trash skill, it's been so much harder this run. Like, it's been seriously actually pretty difficult. We could go up to six days still, and they actually have some good stuff for sale there. Let's, um, okay, let's actually learn that. Now I'm gonna go there. Let's do it. Um, someone's on fire. That's not good. <laughs> Hello. Um, let's see if I can trade with you. Oh, you've got a salve injector. And you've got these as well. I'll take both of that. Yeah, totally. That's, that is an awesome dude to be friends with. Can I just see newly sentient beings? Well, I'm, I think that I've made newly sentient beings, so I don't think it's probably a good idea to do, do that. Make him all mad. These shrines, I think, can give you locations as well, so. See who else is around here. Can I talk to this person? Yeah, not not worth trading. There's probably going to be some good stuff. We could probably befriend the mechanists with our tech that we have right now. They probably would be like, anti-matter cell, you are one of us. <laughs> they, they really like when you give them like that stuff. 
a drone out caravan. Am I blind? Where's where's this drone at? I don't see any drone ads. Oh, okay, here they are. I had a feeling that they were over here, so the answer was yes, I am blind. Oh, look, they've got really valuable artifacts. I kind of want to know what that is. Can I figure it out before I buy it? I... No. Well, it's probably like Zeta Chrome or something. So if I can trade for it, I'm going to try and do it. I bet it's data crumb. Um, I kind of want to keep the halberd. I'm not sure if I want to get rid of that. If I can trade away. All right, yeah, we've got like, look at all this stuff that we have. Like all of this is just really should go. All that should go. And I have like all that too. Look at that. I could easily afford maybe even both of them. Yeah, let's uh, let's do let's do a little something like uh, like that if I can. I don't know. I think we're gonna have to get rid of uh, some grenades as well, or something. <laughs> Maybe something a little more valuable as well. Maybe let's get rid of um, chem cell and some other cells. I don't know. The book I want to donate, I think. I don't think I can afford both these things by looks of it. Okay, well, let's, uh, let's get the more valuable of them. We'll do something like that, and I guess I'll keep all of my more valuable gems. Something like... Uh, let's go just one of those, like that yeah sure thank you you're doing business with you and now i have a lot of water that's fine i'll probably be able to get something else valuable um i think i th still have psychometry <gasps> metamorphic polygel that clones items um i think or is it People? Is it people or items? I, f I think that... Oh man. I think it's... Uh, what One of the two. Either is fantastic, honestly. An acid weep. Okay. I thought I've been here before, but it looks like I haven't. It's weird how I'm getting like, the dungeon music for here. This is definitely not dungeon place. Oh look, he's got um, some really good ingredients here. I think I want the congealed blaze. Maybe that. That and that. That all is like really good ingredients for stuff. For cooking. Um, the Gambler of Brazen. It's a book, is what it is. I'm gonna do it. Thank you. And check out this check out this book. You can read it. Oh wow. Okay, cool. I've learned to cook that now. And so I got that recipe. And I have those ingredients. So now I will be able to do that. What was What was the thing? Eh. Not that great of a recipe, but if you don't have that one skill, this that is a way to get recipes with cooking. Not the best way. It is a way, though. A grenadier. Okay, so they have a bunch of different grenades here. Sure, let's, uh, let's pick up some grenades. If I wanted to learn what all of these were, how much would that cost me? Like 400-ish? Okay. I might be able to do that. I think I can I can make this work. Yeah, let's do this. Cool, thank you. And I still have 100 drams left. See? This is how you turn rocks into useful items. A 
thermal grenade too. That's like a really good grenade. Resonance gate grenade one is not that good, but it's, it's okay. Yeah, these are unlikely to be great. A high explosive can be good for like knocking down walls. And an acid grenade as well is good for like knocking down walls. Oh. Dawn gliders. There's like a legendary dawn glider over there. That did not seem to be friendly. With the uh, dromad here. What are you doing there, buddy? Oh, what's uh? What are these? I can't afford that. But the small gold flecked tube. That sounds. That sounds like it could potentially be something very good. Potentially. Uh, where's my... Da, 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 da. I'm not seeing my... Yeah, here it is. Here. Uh, sure. Yeah. Cool. If this is what I think it is. Oh, okay. It's Uber, Uber Nostrum Injector, which is a good item. Don't get me wrong, but I thought it might be an Eater's Inject... The Eater's Nectar, but... Nah. So that's one way to get uh, <clears throat> a ton of really good items. My gosh. Okay, I did learn that. Um, did I not learn the other things I identified here? Yeah, I don't think I learned them. Okay, well that's not good. The Resonance Wark one, I do kind of want to know because it's easier to craft than the other one. And the Thermal 2 should make it so I can make like lava like really easy if I wanted to. If I wanted to print money, as some might say. Ah, uh, the Dawn Glider. I forgot about them. Okay. Can I get that fire taken out? Okay, the fire is out. That Dawn Glider it got hurt, I think. Now I, I'm healing? Okay, cool. And now it's night, apparently. Well, I think that that's a pretty good sign that I should um, probably not go that way, but go around. Talking Polyform. It's a ruin. Oh, perfect. I was hoping for a ruin. This might have some good stuff down below, if it has downward stairs. If it doesn't, I might be able to make a way to go down. There are ways to do it. Yeah, this, this looks like this might just be not a great rune. <laughs> okay, at least the music changed. We got the desert music. That's nice. A little change in scenery and ambiance. Yeah, just a little arc scone. I don't know why it's a scone. Whatever. Okay. Nothing. Nothing. Okay. That is a real shame. <laughs> the music's so intense. In this biome. I think that this might have an inside here. It looks like. Oh, hello. I didn't even get a good look at the enemy before we had killed it. Maybe. Ah, whatever. Yeah, we can go there. Yeah, that way. This looks like there might be, yeah, something, no, nothing really, okay, unfortunate. I have heard that it is sometimes worth just kind of exploring the desert because you can see legendary um, enemies really and allies really easily. 
Oh, look, there's another ruin here. Cool. Well, why don't I just, um... I don't know, are we inspired right now? I think we might be inspired. Maybe we could go with, uh... Some pickles and... I don't know. That. And see what happens. Yeah, not that great. And it's okay. Okay. Now we're getting back to that intense music. Oh, look. Um, it's not even worth picking up at this point. If there's downward stairs, then this is a good ruin for me. <clears throat> if not, I have a waste of time. Yeah, I know there's an auto explore button. I think it's actually, yeah, it's zero is auto explore. Cool. Let's do that and see what it auto finds for me. Oh, hello. Keep on auto exploring for me, buddy. Thank you. Something chirped. Um, keep on going. Let's see what we find. I like this. I like auto exploring. Pretty lax for me. Oh, hello. There we go. They're dead. There's a glass bottle here. I mean, glass bottles are not worthless items. Oh, there's trash. Yeah. Oh, hello. Got a little info there. Nothing to laugh at. Oh, hello. There's a musket turret, a rifle turret, and a micro turret. That's, that's cute. A micro turret? Like, what even is that? Is it like trying to inject me or something? I don't know. <laughs> I'm gonna just kind of try and explore a little bit to see what we can find. Anything up here? No. Okay. There's... Yeah, gonna be these guys. I knew there was gonna be some of them around here somewhere, but they're... They don't even have, like, stuff worth looting, really. And the stuff you can make grenades from... So that is an option. I think we might want to go back to looting somewhere. Because we don't really have much tradable, valuable stuff. I'm glad we got the Uber no Ostrom. That actually is gonna very much increase our chances of survival in the long term. And this is actually, as people have said, one of the easier biomes to explore and get a good look at, at your surroundings, but unfortunately it is night right now, so I'm getting a great perspective on things. Yep, but look at this. Now we've, we've got some lair. Some dude. I can just like get some. Yeah. Um. I mean, these these items are not terrible, not great either. There might be like chances for like diplomacy or something here. That can happen with these types of places. It looks like they just have like a ton of guns though. Like this is kind of actually kind of funny. There's an absurd amount of these dudes with guns trying to shoot out this dude that has just this axe. You know, like even hitting their own guys who are charging me. Oh man. Hilarious. Unstoppable chip chop. Oh my gosh. Craziness. This one's engraved. Let's look at it. Maybe I can learn something. Yes! Thank you. I'm gonna disassemble you. <laughs> that was kind of awful. What was this quest called? Recover at 
Salatara. Well, where's Salatara? Tell me. Do tell me. Um, I know. Yeah, here we go. Historic sites. No. Is Salatara one of these? No. Yeah, I don't think there's uh, anything else I know about Salatar. Okay, whatever. Maybe I'll learn it after I've fought more of these guys. Oh, there's downstairs here. This this could have potentially cybernetics in it. That is something that's possible. I'm gonna just kind of see who else is around here. Honestly, with our armor, these guys can't even hurt me. Um, can I have a look at that? Did not learn anything. Okay. Yeah, it's definitely worth learning about history if you can. I don't know if it's at this point worth disassembling every single item though. I think I'm gonna just go and auto explore a little bit more. Yep. I knew there was probably more. Anything else? No. Okay. Well, now it is day. Which means I should probably go exploring, but I don't know. Okay, I want to see what else we can find in here. Looks like it's more of these dudes. Um, a pal yeah. Okay. Yeah, they don't really even hurt me at this point. Hello. Jeez. Okay. Yeah, we're definitely a little overpowered after deep diving into the caves. Coming back up here to the surface is kind of a trivial task. Hold on, what was this that... An Iron Maiden? What is that? Okay, so it's like a trap. Interesting. So maybe I could like make enemies step on said trap. Huh. Okay. <clears throat> Interesting. Keep on going down. Let's see what else we can find down here. Got a good feeling we'll find something. Oh, there's kudzu. Ah! I hate kudzu. Our handgun rifle should take care of that pretty easy, though. Yeah. Um, nope. <clears throat> Not gonna go down there. Oh, hello. <clears throat> That's a shame. A single hit. <laughs> Decap dude. Okay. I've got a feeling there might be some useful stuff here though. I don't want to fight the kudzu, but I'm curious this guy might have like some unique items or something around here. Uh, that's the the plant thing that like yeah grows around here. It, oh, ah, cracked my shard mail. These things are so annoying. Oh, hello.
Alright, I'm gonna end this here. Sorry, I got something in my throat. Sorry.